Hello folks, Jared and welcome back to Racing Else and today we will be trying out uh, the Ford GTR which just happens to be one of the most popular cars in the game but uh, oddly enough I haven't drove one of these before like at all. Well I did have a couple of test runs but that's really, uh, really it so it means that this is one of the few cars which are super popular but like I don't know why. Well I guess we're gonna figure that out even though I already did. Because from what I've seen, this is probably one of the uh, easiest R2 class cars to drive. It's up there with the Bentley, I would say. So, uh, well, we're gonna hop into a lobby and uh, try to do some things. I do, in fact, have three here. So, in case we lose one immediately, no worries. Anyways, we're gonna try to have a test run first, obviously. Because that's how we roll any other forts in the lobby. Well, the GTRs, anyway. Uh, I don't think so. What's this? Probably a, yeah, force painted car like that. I actually have one of those uh, in matte yellow, which is of course handy. I guess you can as well challenge him while we're at it. So the car launches very very similar to the Evo 8, which means that you have to stop driving um, just after the second light comes on. All shifts should be late. I didn't in fact check that. Well, this car is capable of hitting uh, 6.7s. And, uh, well, I'm not sure if we'll uh, be hitting that, but we can definitely try. So here we have one of the other cards which was given away back in 2014, the Z4 G3, but unlike the GTR, this is a pain in the ass to drive. Everyone is checking out these days, well, not these days, just, you know, as I'm trying to film a practice, and I guess that's not very convenient, is it? I'm just gonna put the volume up just, you know, a little bit. Uh, I think the actual uh, audio of the device is actually quieter when I'm recording, which is of course handy, because you guys obviously want to hear my fantastic voice. And yes, that was uh, fucking sarcasm. Uh, let's check this out. So I did in fact have a practice run, but it was actually lost. So let's try to get a good run, actually. We're gonna try to not hold for the, uh, the long again. There we go. Okay, the shifting wasn't on point. Uh, it's kind of similar to, Z to the ZR1. We did hit uh, the red limiter there on the first two gears, I believe. Maybe even on the third. Yeah, okay, it's not the best of times. Also, that guy did not use NOS, even though, uh, even though he's maxed. The rating clearly shows that. Also, I thought the GTR was maxed at 1680, but I guess we really have a good tune for it, which is, of course, very nice. Uh, so now that we had a single uh, perfect launch, we're of course gonna go and uh, change our betting preference to pinks. Not with everyone, obviously, but uh, we'll see who challenges us. Okay, so this is one of the few cards which could potentially pink slip us, but it's a free runner, goddammit. There we go, this should be a 6.7 now, probably a high one, but still, a 6.7. If it's gonna load, of course, there you go, that's a 6.7, I'm proud of that, even though most people probably wouldn't be. Good okay, enough. so a friendly person actually decided that he does want a pink slip against us, so, uh, well, I mean, if the race is actually gonna go to you, this should be interesting. My first ever for the GTR pinks. And, you know, we're gonna see how it goes. Hopefully decent, we'll see. Oh my god. <laughs> Shit. Well, um, that ended up terribly. It's weird, I thought it, uh, that the fucking release I did was on point, but... It wasn't on the correct one, as it appears. Shit, we could have taken him with a 6.8 as well. Well, uh, looks like we'll be trying that again. Okay. So, same person, round number two. If I get trashed all this uh, this time around, that would just, you know, be a full fucking circle of shit. There you go. Okay, the first gear was not on point, but I think we got him. So at the very least, we should be, well, net positive, not net neutral. Is that how you say it? I don't know. 
but it was a halfway decent time, you know. Not a 6.7, but, but, well, it was a perfect launch with that reaction time, so. Fair enough. So I'm gonna try to do GTR things until I lose this one, which means that this video should end in, you know, like a minute or so after I complain about fucking losing it. Uh, still, he's taking his time there. I'm not sure if he wants the pink slip, uh, but uh, Deja Vu is back in the lobby, so... We're gonna be pink slipping again for sure. Did he time out? I think he timed out. Oh well. Now what is the... Uh, one more. Okay. I guess this is the last one then. I mean, we could potentially uh, win our car back or we can lose two GTRs. Well, uh, you know, just wait 30 seconds and you'll see, I guess. Let's do it. I'm trying to think of something clever to say, but this just happens so often, like, I'm trying to build up to this amazing moment where, you know, I managed to clutch a fucking, uh, pink, pink slip near the end, but I just fell and, well, um, uh, that's, that's a GG, uh, you know, I guess, indeed, anyways, uh, thank you guys for watching, my name's Jerry, and, uh, fuck, I need to find some more GTA. Uh, GTRs, I have no idea what that was, but yeah. Bye.